I'd like to introduce you all to what I think is one of the most useful applications that I've got on my computer and on my Android, Android phone called Evernote. Now, I was in the middle of doing a blog post about um, very useful applications that any small business might have, particularly somebody in apparel decorating, and I started thinking about the way I use this Evernote application, and and it really fits. So what you'll notice, first of all, is that this is not a screen capture of my phone. It's a it's an application. It's a desktop software application. And that's what Evernote is. It's a way to take notes um, and to do screen captures, things like that, that you can go back and forth between uh, desktop software a, an app inside of Chrome and other browsers and also on your smartphone and kind of interrelate them all. And that, that's really what I want to stress here. So what I'm going to do, for example, is I'm going to pretend that, you know, we're together and we're taking a phone call on someone that might be interested in getting some custom shirts done. Doesn't matter if it's DTG or embroidery or bling or vinyl or what have you. But what I would first do is I would open up this application and I would start a new notebook. Now me, I'm just gonna right click and let's say it's from one of my friends at uh, Franklin Street Furniture. I know this company, they're great and they won't mind me using them as an example. So I'm just gonna type in Franklin Street, this is the name of my notebook. Now this is kind of the equivalent to me bringing out the legal pad on my desk when the phone rings and writing Franklin Street at the top. And that's what you're gonna notice is that's the kind of application this is. It is Evernote, it's a notebook. So I'm just gonna go make a new note and we're gonna call this, um, I don't know, September T-shirt job. And you, you do the same thing here that you would normally do on a notepad, except you have some addition, additional examples or um, a little bit of a little bit of benefit to doing it on screen instead. First of all, you can read all the letters that I'm going to write now write down. So let's say they need 120 shirts, and I can take take these notes as we're talking by September 23rd. They've got a low budget, but want great quality, of course. Black or gray, mixed sizes, because I'm gonna ask my customers those questions. I'm, I'm gonna ask them, have you gotten printed t-shirts before, embroidered t-shirts before? And I might explain that process. If you've listened to one of our uh, Custom Apparel Startups podcast, we talk about that kind of thing a lot. But basically I'm gonna take all my notes, you know, they were quoted, he's telling me on the phone they were quoted $15 each by one company, but they were rude. I mean, all the same things that you would say, they sound like good people and maybe good long-term customers. And you can say, really want the quality, may want caps. All these things are just what you might write down on, the, on, a, on a legal pad while you're talking to somebody on the phone. Might be able to go $15 if quality is better. Okay, so I'm gonna take all these notes and while we're talking on the phone and let's say the customer also wants you to go to their website so you can see what the website looks like and what the, uh, you know, what the, what the logo looks like, et cetera. Maybe they want pictures of some of their furniture on shirts because this is a custom furniture maker. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go over to my browser and I'm just gonna go to their website. And it comes up and it's a beautiful website. And what they what they want is they want something that maybe, maybe they want something with their logo on it. And they're gonna send you the logo, but just so I can remember where I am and what they're showing me, I'm gonna pull up, I'm gonna click on the little elephant up here and I'm going to choose the clip to Evernote function. And then I'm gonna go down here to my organizational table and I'm gonna find Franklin Street Furniture. Whoops, wait a minute, let me just sync that up. Hit the sync button. Now I've got this set to sync every few hours instead of every few minutes. So right now, I'm gonna close it, open it again, and there's Franklin Street. So I'm gonna set on Franklin Street, and whatever I do here now is automatically going to be put into the, the same notes in the main application. So I can actually save this entire page. I can just hit save. And it's going to put it 
attached to that same note that in that notebook that I was just working on. Why is that better than bookmarking it here? I think that's that's pretty obvious. I mean, I could go to favorites and I could keep that here and then I've talked to 15 customers in a day and I don't remember which is which. So this keeps it all straight. I can also do something like, okay, the tables, um, maybe this is one that they particularly want to feature. So I'm going to go back up to Evernote and instead of, instead of the whole thing, I'm just going to take a screenshot and I'm going to do this table. And maybe I'll say they really want this design on it, or I can even add a tag or add a remark. Want something like this. Okay, you see what I'm doing over here? Okay, and then I'm gonna hit save and it's gonna save that to the book. And then as we talk, we're gonna talk about the kind of shirts that they want. So I might go to my wholesaler, let's say it's Alpha Broder, and they want a standard t-shirt, so let's take a look at those and they want this kind of a long sleeve in this really ugly mustard color. So I'm gonna look at this maybe like, uh, you know, in a different shirt, and what I can do again is, I'm kind of putting together the story of this phone call here, right? So I'm gonna do, do a screenshot and I'm just gonna take this. Now I, I don't have to remember it right now, I don't have to stop and write down a number, I'm just gonna hit, make sure I'm back into the, um, into the Franklin Street book, and I'm gonna hit save. And now when I go back to my notes and I sync up, now you'll see all of these things are in here in one place. I've got my list of notebooks. Maybe it's the phone calls that, I, that I've made or talked to people. And maybe I go back here later on and I'm looking for an inspiration and I am just wanna type in furniture, T-shirts. I don't know. I have no idea what I'm going to get. Okay, so maybe I've got some of these and I just want to, oh yeah, I like that shirt. I'm not going to exactly do, I'm not going to exactly do these, but maybe I want to add this to my notebook stack and I can do this anytime just for kind of a, just for kind of a brainstorming session. Think about this as the ability to do your own little mini Pinterest for, uh, for each customer that you talk to on the phone. Okay, I'm going to come back here. I hit sync again. And now all of these things is in here. So the next time when I'm ready to do a quote, when I'm ready to um, create a to-do list or a workflow based on these customers, now I can do that here. And I can even just add a new note. And here is my job to-do list for Franklin. I come down here and I make it little boxes so I can check them off and do quote, schedule job, you get the idea. Now, at any point, I can record a voice note, I can t attach a PDF file, I can set a timer or an alarm on it. Um, I can even chat with other people that are in the company if you're in a big company that sign up for the paid service. But everything that you've seen here is free. And not only is all this great, but there's actually an Android application where I can pull all of the stuff up on my phone. So if I get a phone call from a customer um, and I'm on the road and they wanna talk about the job, then I can just, I can just pull it up in Evernote. Um, so it's a great application. It's something that if you really kind of use it religiously and, and make it part of your day, that you'll definitely stay more organized. It's a great place to keep all of your information and maybe cut down the time it takes for you to get from phone call to quote, from quote to job, and to get those jobs done right, right after the other because you're not looking for random pieces of paper, no, um, you know, clips on the internet that you've bookmarked, etc. So that's Evernote, and it's one of the great productivity tools, I think, for people that are in the custom t-shirt business.